Sponsored by Fletcher's Flies, along with Salt Rights and Industry Portage. Yo, yo, what's up everyone? This is Kantanaka, Voice for Fish. I'm in North Carolina, back in my roots, and I'm gonna do a little bit of bass fishing. That's right, bass fishing. Uh, it has been a while since I've used conventional gear ever since I picked up a fly rod. It's been nothing but fly fishing for me. Don't have a chance to get out to the stream right now, so I'm just gonna do some conventional fishing for a good old largemouth bass. Uh, I'm gonna use my bait caster. Today I'm gonna be using a Shimano Sitica bait caster. 20 pound test. I also have a Claris rod. This is also the new blank, so I can't wait to uh, check it out. I have the old Claris, um, but this is a new blank, so it should be good. Uh, I am using a medium weight rod with a fast action, and primarily I'm just going to be using crankbaits today because it's cold. Um, I mean, I know I should be taking my time probably with slower presentation, but I could. I don't have much time, so I cover more ground with a crankbait. Which that's the thing about crankbaits is uh, at least you can cover a lot more ground faster. Anyway, see you guys in the water. Yeah, wish for fish, baby. Nice fish. I've mentioned before about fishing structure, and this is a perfect example of things you want to look for. Now what I did is I just cast my lure right on the outer edge of this, and I pulled a fish right out of here. Oh yeah. Pulled him out of that little weed bed there. So I just crushed it in an hour. Actually, it was uh, less than an hour. Caught five bass. Uh, the first bass. Uh, I thought I was recording. I don't know, because when I looked down, it wasn't recording. Uh, so I'm going to have to play the tape and see if I recorded it, which is sad, because of course, it was my biggest fish. And then just not being used to uh, uh, you know, being out on the water, I didn't even take a still of it from Instagram, which is the dumbest thing I've ever done. But, 
important thing is I got it there, got my hands wet. I was using the uh, Rapala XR8 the entire time, casting it out, just jigging it uh, while I was slow retrieving. I was actually uh, going at a pretty fast retrieve considering the air temperature is 36 degrees outside. It's the uh, end of March, still cold. Um, there was rain yesterday. Little, it, it's a nice day today, very windy. But uh, overall, a successful day considering I fished less than an hour and caught five fish. So, so anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully, I'll be back on the stream soon. Uh, you guys have been asking for uh, videos, and uh, all of you guys that were asking about the videos were fly fishermen. So, uh, unfortunately, this wasn't a fly fishing video, but. There really isn't a place here except for a stocky pond, and I'm not going to go fish a stocky pond. So, thanks for watching, guys, and hopefully I'll see you guys on the stream. Hey, what's going on, everyone? Thanks for watching. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do, because I'm constantly updating new footage all the time. So you can do so by clicking this right here. Also, check out our website at www.wishforfishtv.com. You can also follow us on Instagram and Twitter at wishforfishtv. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'll catch you guys on the water.